crispy. Hey, what's good, viewer? This is Spanky. Today I've got the Marvel Legends Infinite Series Blizzard because he's cold and he has ice powers. I don't know much about this character. Uh, not really at all. We got some cool side art of him right there and right there. On the back, let's see. Let's see what we can learn about him. You can pause this and read it. Common thug turned powerful villain. Donnie Gill paralyzes enemies with Arctic Blast. I guess you didn't have to pause it because I just read it out loud. Here's the rest of the characters that come with this box set. I will be reviewing them all. So if you'd like to check them out, I'd really appreciate it. Let's open it up. So throughout the figure, we have some parts that are molded in white plastic and some that are molded in blue. The blue molded plastic is kind of pearlescent and really shiny, and the, the white plastic is actually just the body, I believe, maybe some other parts, but this is actually sculpted white with blue paint throughout. Um, the head sculpt looks really well done. I like the, the white hair. Uh, the blue doesn't seem to really show through many parts on the head here. There's a little bit of weird sculpt going on there. I think that's just the manufacturing error where they cut it off the assembly line or something like that. Here is the white body with the paint, blue paint. It looks pretty good. You see some white showing through there. Uh, no blue on there. I got a little bit of a weird gap on mine. I'm not sure what that's about. Take a look at the arm right here. See, that's just painted on white. The blue showing through a little bit on that. You can see it on the hinge there a little bit up top. But it is a nice shiny kind of white makes it look like snow I like that a lot same with the blue paint there on the uh, we call it ab let me take a look at his butt and then we get the shiny pearlescent blue here for the legs that's definitely a uh, blue sculpted legs and then we get white sculpted uh, calves and feet with blue paint apps you can kinda see the difference here this is definitely a darker blue than the rest of the figure I'm not sure why they did that throughout the figure the blue is pretty even but right here on the calves, for some reason, it just all of a sudden went darker blue. I don't think that's a lighting issue at all. It's just the reason why they sculpted it like that. I don't know. Or the reason why they painted it like that. I don't know. Uh, kind of weird. Not horrible. At least it's not all throughout the figure. And at least it's just one small part where they messed up like that. But still, I paid money for it. So quit messing up. Anyways, let's get into the articulation. There's not a lot blocking his head, so she, he should get good articulation out of that and he does the exorcist he doesn't have any armor or anything so we should get some good articulation out of him again this feels like it's it's on some kind of like a ratchet joint there it's kind of weird it feels like a play arts kai joint i've been seeing that a lot in this build a figure wave upper uh bicep swivel double jointed elbow wrist hinge with the wrist swivel ab joint doesn't go back too far which is surprising sorry it's hard to focus and then we got a little gap here I'm not too thrilled with that for some reason it just didn't come out even you can kinda actually slide it back and forth a little bit that's weird I've never seen that before whist, whist, <laughs> waist swivel His legs go up that far go back that far upper thigh swivel we get a calf swivel seen that a lot on these Hulk build a figure figures, uh, double jointed knee here, and then we get the wrist or <laughs> ankle hinge with the uh, what do you call this ankle rocker is what we're coining it. So I would I would kind of recommend it uh, unless you're not if you're not trying to build the bath and you're not partial to this character at all then maybe pass. It would have been nice if it came with some kind of you know effect, you know like an ice effect or just something because it's kind of a basic figure. It came with two pretty big uh, Build-A-Figure pieces, so I guess they didn't find any extra package uh, space to put anything in there, but it would have been it would have been nice if they added something because it's just a really basic figure, not much going on to it, easy paint apps and anything, so I just, I feel like I want a little bit more out of it. Check out Big Bad Toy Store for the rest of this line, including Blizzard, uh, and you can build a big Build-A-Figure Hulk, which I'll be having here soon. Just keep watching my reviews. I really do appreciate you, uh, taking the time out of your day to watch this. Um, other than that, hope you have a good day. Like, comment, and subscribe. Until next time, later.